Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTicker. In this, I'm going to do the overcharging prevention mechanism test in the OnePlus Nord 2 after the recent software update. Yes, friends, this is a question which has been requested by a few of my subscribers asking me to make a video. After this December security patch update, let's see what's going to happen with the overcharging prevention test. So, only few phones will be able to have this kind of overcharging prevention mechanism support. So for example, right now the phone charges to 100% right. So when I try to connect this uh, speed meter, as you can see, this is a charging speed meter. So right now it's showing exactly 0 amperes. So as soon as I connect to the smartphone, it will try to show you some charges going into the mobile phone, as you can see exactly. So right now it's showing charging right. After some time, after maybe 2 or 3 minutes or 4 minutes, this complete charging will uh, go away and we'll be getting the message saying charged indication. So after the charged indication and when this kind of charging icon, when it goes away, then if the phone is charging, that means the phone doesn't have any kind of overcharging prevention mechanism. That's how we'll be able to come to the conclusion. So let's see friends, how long the phone gonna take to completely show like zero, zero amperes. So there are a few phones. There are a few phones which are actually supported with the zero, zero amperes. Even when 100% charged, the phone will not take any amount of current at all, not even small minute amount. But few phones, they will try to take the charge, maybe small amount of power. But let's see whether the OnePlus Nord 2 has got that kind of uh, mechanism after the recent update or not. We'll be able to get to know. So we should give some time. This mechanism will not get activated immediately. We should give some time, maybe 2 minutes, 5 minutes or 10 minutes as well. So don't worry, I'll give 15 minutes of time for the OnePlus Nord 2 to get this mechanism to activate. So right now anyway, the phone charges to 100%, right? So right now you can see the charging in indication is completely gone away and it showed charged indication as well. Okay. Now we'll be able to calculate what's happening in the amperes. It's kind of consuming little by little. And there is no live wallpaper. There is no SIM card. There is no mobile data. Nothing is running in the background in this device. I'll try to keep this phone side and again it'll be back after 10 minutes of time. Okay. Perfect. Right. 10 minutes. You can look at the time. 5.33, 5.43. Again, I'll be back after some time. So right now as you can see friends, we are getting close to exactly 10 minutes of time continuously doing this kind of overcharging prevention test and you can clearly see the phone taking a little bit kind of small amount of power. Small amount of power, it's still the phone is consuming at this moment. As you can see, small amount, not a huge, but continuously it's taking the power. Even after 100% charged as well, still you can see 14 amperes, 10 amperes and 4 amperes. It's not showing any kind of 0, 0 sign at this moment, even after 10 minutes of time. As you can see the time, 10 minutes has happened. So definitely friends, the OnePlus Nord 2 at this moment after the update, there is no overcharging prevention mechanism. And you might be wondering, is there any other phone with 00 amperes? Yes, there is a couple of other phones which can actually do 00 amperes as well. If you want, you can check out those videos. Just type in the YouTube overcharging test SciTech Guru and you can actually find my videos, which are actually, uh, you can see the live proof as well. And that's it friends, thank you for watching, stay tuned for more updates and I can definitely test this kind of mechanism working or not in other smartphones as well. Meanwhile, signing off until then, stay tuned for more updates. Bye.